this program is very simple. We are uh, parents. And moreover, I am conducting this program not as a faculty, otherwise uh, expert in uh, this ICT, ICT area. Of course, I am working as a faculty in uh, information technology only. I used with many of the softwares since long years, more than decades, so one or two decades. And uh, of course, whatever we are learning, whatever we are able to teach at least some few part of our knowledge to our own children is an amazing experience. So as part of that, I would like to transfer at least little bit of this ICT knowledge to my own son. And moreover, he is also doing intermediate second year. And he is also, uh, of course, he joined engineering, intermediate uh, student. So I cannot uh, sit along with him to share this knowledge because he won't sit for a long time in the learning process along with me. So what I thought, to transfer this knowledge, I thought of to conduct online program because he's also sitting in the next room to me and he's also in online. So this is a great, uh, amazing experience as a parent. And experience, many FTPs are going on in India abroad uh, to give the knowledge how we can teach the students in online because the pandemic situation, the COVID, the every education institution right now beginning to the PG, EG, any level, they are coming to the online. So we are thinking only in how we can transfer the knowledge to the students. We are not giving more emphasis how students will be catching that what we are transferring through online. So that, uh, I thought, so why not, why don't we conduct a program to students in age group of our own children, our own child. So that is the initiation of this program. Immediately, I make it as the plan and uh, of course it's a very it's a very good experience to attract more than 30 40 students all over india so unless until we equip the student to receive in a proper way whatever the technology we are using the transfer the knowledge is a failure one because the receiving end is supposed to be strong enough to receive all the things so that is a missing link as per my observation so we to that angle i decided First, start with the screen capturing. From the screen capturing onwards up to, he has to send the information and that is a preparation presentation to the college. So this is what I come up with the presentation, the, the schedule. I think the schedule also mostly, mostly in the sense 90 percentage satisfying the students. Yesterday we have seen some tools. Uh, what are the tools we have seen? The Audacity, what is that, the Canva and uh, the Render Forest and uh, Cladio and Autodraw. So these are the tools we practiced yesterday we can talk. And today topic we are going to see the power tone. It's a PowerPoint and cartoon. Combination is power tone, P-O-W. P-O-W-T-O-O-N. So there. Uh, so, the excuse me, sir. Uh, yes, yes, Shika, tell me. Um, sir, I didn't uh, attend yesterday's um, we, um, webinar, but I already know that how to use Render Forest. Very good. I know. I visited. I watched your video also. Okay, sir. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, Thank why you, don't, sir. Why don't, why don't you show your presentation and uh, share with the participants? Because we uh, have the children from all over India. So, which presentation? Anything, as you like. Sir, render for his presentation. According to your wish, my dear, you can take in some places audio, you want to merge the songs in between, you want to sing. So, magics, we can do anything, we can do the many things. We'll do some practice in that. And uh, apart from that, what else? Yeah, the power tone, the PowerPoint, Audacity, and how to convert the audio from one format to another format MP4 to MP3, MP3. To. That already, of course, we have seen that yesterday. The Cladio software also helped us in that angle. So today also we'll see that. And uh, if you want to go for a presentation, uh, we definitely want some pictures, right? And uh, we need some audio. We need some images. So this audio, video, images also available in a massive quantity in some websites. We will see that websites. 
And uh, one more thing, mainly we have to understand and the parents also should take care about this. The information which are available in internet, we should not use free of cost. We should never think that everything is for us. Because all the entities, all the pictures, images, voice, everything is with right protection, with their own, uh, the copyright. So we cannot use just like that. They will sue us. So that is why, just for the practice purpose, no botheration, we can use. But if you want to upload to video, otherwise if you want to present in a open public forum, we should be very conscious. So we have to go to the location where the things are available with certification. That means without any uh, the legal action. So those kind of sites are available. Even in the online, your teachers, your faculty is also going to share so many information to you on coming class sections in your college or schools. Those information also with right protection, route protection. So if you are picking any information, we have to citation. The citation is we have to refer this property, this thing is belongs to that particular X and Y. Like that we have to citation should be proper. And uh, somebody will be giving free of cost. Free of cost in the sense, free use is possible. And they will be giving permission to make use of that, but they will not permit us to use that entity for the commercial point of view. So different angles of permission also is there. We should understand what the meaning of that permission. Accordingly, we can do that. But that portion is not part of this program. That is why I'm not going to discuss that in larger way. This is only a practical session. We can use anything because we are not going to upload for any commercial otherwise public forum, right? So this is also one of the information. And uh, some sites also available, the Pixabay. Pixabay is one site. In that site, we can get millions of pictures, images, the free of cost, uh, without any license problem, okay? And apart from that, if you're downloading a picture, it's a very bigger picture, it's a quantity, the size is very heavy the 5 MB, otherwise 20 MB pictures. We cannot make that picture as our PowerPoint presentation because it occupies more space. So how to reduce that size? It should also be discussed. If you want to upload uh, your own picture in applications, the MZ application, otherwise engineering application, they will permit us only upload 25 KB picture. We cannot minimize the picture size. So how we can do that? Some free tools also available. Uh, the pic resize, picture resize itself is a website name. P I C R E Z I S I Z D. Pic resize. That also when website we can upload our bigger size of image. We can decrease to lesser image without decreasing or losing the quant quality of the image. So that also one um, site is there. And audio, the background music. Yesterday also we used some uh, some ocean uh, ocean noise or some other the. Mm, the birds, noise. So these kind of noises, voices, audio are also available that we can download with the help of a site sound forest and the sound cloud also is there. That also one of the website we can download. And the flicker.com also on website. From there we can download images, the good images. And uh, audio, uh, the music, background music, only instruments, only some other noises, some other music. So throughout the globe so many collections are there uh, that is audioblogs.com audioblogs.com so that also on site we will visit their site how to download and all we'll see one by one so before that uh, i am inviting shika to present your presentation are you ready yes sir right so in the bottom of the screen you can see yes and I share the screen now. So before yes. selecting your presentation, left to bottom, you can see audio with audio present, right? So check that. Then only your audio will be uh, audible to others. Uh, sir, share screen. Yes. Uh, excuse me, sir. Uh, do I have to check the audio settings? Yes, yes. No need, no need, no need. If you are, uh, if you are clicking the share screen. Right, sir. Yeah, one pop-up comes on the screen, right? Right, 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 right. So after selecting the box, before getting mm, the uh, the show, the left side, if you're noting, noticing, two check boxes will be there. One is display with audio. Okay, okay. Share computer sound. Correct. Right, 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 right. Okay. Sir. Yes.
Very nice, very nice, Ashika. Uh, she's Arna. I'm her mom, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I have also learned this thing today. Very good. Okay. Now I'm sharing the screen.